Building with Papa. Okay, I just purchased this backpack sprayer. It's run with a battery, and this thing really works awesome. I like the fact that it has the backpack cushions. It was easy to put on and to get to all the switches. Everything goes together quite simple. Follow the steps. Make sure you use the Teflon tape for everything that has uh, threads on it. Okay, this top opens nice. It has a, a screen basket in it so that if you do get any debris in there, it'll catch it so it doesn't get clogged up. As you can see, I've already used it and I have put this tip on um, because I'm using chlorine and um, you know, for any acids or chlorines, things like that, you should use this tip. Okay, make sure you charge the backpack. That's your on and off switch. That knob gives you the volume of fluid you want to come out. There's a fuse, and then they have this charger. Make sure you charge it fully before you use it. It does come with some power, but it's always best to charge it to full capacity. These straps are really comfortable. It was a pleasure working with it. I did a roof. I'm going to show you that. Oh, this little compartment here is where the battery is located that gets charged. They put a little Velcro strap in there to hold it. And it works qu quite well. They give you a variety of tips. This uh, has Teflon tape for everything that you're going to screw on with the threads because you have to put this whole thing together. Uh, that's a nice cone sprayer and they have different spray nozzles and even a double headed one, which I haven't tried, but all depends on what you're spraying. They give you additional washers, uh, fuse, and everything works quite well. Here I am, I'm up on my neighbor's roof trying to get this moldy roof somewhat clean. I'm using the chlorine right now. We're supposed to have rain tomorrow, so it should work really well. I was able to get on the roof and not have to climb all the way up because this sprayer sprayed at least 10 feet. It worked very good. Here I'm doing maintenance on my stones. I haven't done it I usually do it every six months, but it's been about a year since I did the wet it and forget it. And we have a little bit of mold now, and uh, this will clean it right up. I really do like this sprayer. I'm glad I bought it. I don't have to hand pump my sprayers anymore. This is great for all types of things. So I've sprayed chlorine through it now. I've sprayed wet it and forget it on these stones, and then... I made a mixture and made a homemade uh, weed killer, okay? Um, it's vinegar, a gallon of vinegar, a cup of salt, and a little bit of Dawn dish soap. And I sprayed this on and the next morning I went out and looked at it and uh, I couldn't believe the majority of it all withered up already and there's an area that had a lot more weeds that I didn't show in this video and it took care of them. It was really good. All right, I really am impressed with this sprayer. I think it works really great. Building with Papa, like, subscribe, and ring that bell. See you on the next one.